السلام عليكم اهلا وسهلا مرحبا بكم من جديد في درس جديد من سلسلة تعلم اللغة العربية لغير الناطقين بها اليوم سأعلمكم أو سنراجع الحركات Today welcome everyone to another lesson uh, Today we are going to review just a review if you want to learn the vowels the short and long vowels in Arabic you have to go to the playlist in this playlist I find uh, a special lesson just for uh, understanding uh, the vowels, okay? All right, uh, this is just a review and practice. Are you ready? Let's begin. Awesome. Uh, of course, uh, we are going to start um, talking about the uh, long vowels right here. So in Arabic, we have three long vowels alif wab and ya right? alif wab and ya what does alif wab and ya it makes the letters before it pronounced long for example this word talib yeah Talib means student. So ta is not talib, but talib, talib, talib. So it means it immediate longer. The letter wow here, for example, we have zaboon, zaboon. The word zaboon means client, client. So za. Boon. So wow means that long. Zaboon. Zaboon. And the last one is uh, Ya. Medina. Medina. City. So Ya means dead, also long. Medina. Medina. Yeah. For the short vowels, we have a few. This is a big ba, the letter ba, b. So if we have fatha, this is called fatha, this ba is going to be pronounced ba, ba. If it's double, it's going to be pronounced ban, ban. So it's a bit stronger because it's double, it's twice. Yeah? Ba, ban. At the end, you hear like an n sound. That's why it's called tanween, tanween, ban. This little, it looks like a little wow. It makes the letter ba, or any letter of course, bu, bu, bu. It's like bu, but this is long, bu, but it's just bu, bu. Of course, if you have twice, the double, the tanween, it's going to be bun, bun. Bun. You hear the end sound at the end? Bun. That's not a letter, but you just the sound. Bun. And uh, this one is called Kasra. If it's under the letter, in this case we have B, that. So it's going to be pronounced B. B. B is a short for yeah. This is B. This is B. So this B is Medina. And this is just short E. So if we have this letter here, it would be B, which is just B, B, yeah? And this is obviously, it looks the same, but it's double, it's telling me, you're going to have the N again, so it would be bin, bin, bin. And here you have sukun, this circle is called sukun, sukun, it actually came from uh, a sakina, which is like, Quietness, yeah, it's not loud. So we're gonna make this letter B, B, B. And this one, it's the opposite, it's gonna make it stronger. It's Shadda, it's called Shadda, yeah. So it's usually under the Fatha, so it's gonna be B, 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 B. So let's look at some examples. This word is. Anna, I am. 
and now so we have a tau on the top so it's going to be a and now this is the same as this one it's also uh, hamza but it's in the bottom so it's not a anymore it's e now this is ana this is e ismi ismi so we have seen it's the sukun the s so it would be s s s it's not sa it's not su it's not si it's s s ismi ismi my name uh, this word here is ain ain so we have ain the letter ain so it's fatha so it would be a ain this is noon n now the sukun n ain 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 it means i this word next word is kutub 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 Books, yeah, kitab wahid, kutub. So ku, this is ka, so it's ku sound, so ku, chu, kutub. This word, dual, 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 countries. So we have dal, and so it's du, this is fatha, wa, so dual, dual, l. Dual. This word here is shukran. Shukran. Shuk. Shuk. Run. See the tanween, the double. So you're gonna hear like n here. Shukran. Shukran. N. Shukran. There's no n, but you hear it. Shukran. Thank you. Huna is shadda shadda so sha and this dal is has this thing so it's stronger shadda shadda Sh the word shadda actually means this yeah it's called shadda it's strong it's. next word is so sulam or sulam would be would be Salama, actually. So it should be Fatha here. Yeah. Salama. Sa. La. You said that? Salama. 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 That's why you get Salam. Salam. Salam alaikum. Yeah. Salama is to say hello. Wa akhiran, finally. Al. A. Rabia. Well, this is the alif and lam together. Al a ra bi ya al arabia. Okay. Well, this is just a review. Again, go back to the another uh, video at the beginning of the playlist to uh, study the vowels and uh, long vowels and short vowels. I hope this has been helpful. 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 <laughs> And hopefully, I'll see you in the next video. Shukran. Ma'asalama.